Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we have some pretty unexpected news, but it appears that we have a set list for Ninjago Summer 2022. And this is definitely surprising. Usually this kind of news doesn't get revealed until February. So to have it within the first 10 days of the year is pretty cool. But basically we're just going to take a look at this list. Now the first set here is Ninja Dragon Temple. This is a junior set, but for a four plus set is very expensive at $40. So yeah, that, that's definitely quite a lot. And then we get to the main sets. Jay's Golden Dragon Motorbike. You're gonna see the words Golden Dragon a lot here. And I'm guessing not all of these sets are, well, Golden Dragons, but rather maybe that could just be a style or just a, a title maybe. So I'm guessing this Golden Dragon Motorbike is probably a motorbike and not a dragon. Anyways, next up is Cole's Golden Dragon Cruiser. Uh, this one is for $40. I'm guessing by the title, this is probably some sort of vehicle. Uh, and then there's also Zane's Golden Dragon Raider, $30. Also probably like some sort of vehicle. And then this is interesting, Dark Temple, $80. This is definitely one of the uh, sets out here that seems the most interesting. And I guess it's, it's just self-explanatory, probably some sort of villain temple maybe. But that's really cool. I like the, uh, the sound of that. And then what's even cooler after this is the Crystal King for $70. This could definitely uh, suggest what the style or theme of this season could be. Uh, we don't know if this set wave is for a season or if it's just gonna be like core or legacy or something, but say this is for a season, well, then maybe the season will, will have some sort of underground element. Maybe the Crystal King could be some sort of villain. Anyways, next up is Kai's Golden Dragon Raider, uh, a Kai vehicle. We're seeing all four of the original Ninja getting sets here. This one is, is a lot, this one is $90. So probably a pretty big set, but it just gets more expensive after that. A set just called Golden Dragon. Maybe this is an actual dragon, or maybe it's just a placeholder name. This is a lot. This one is $140. That is the most expensive set on this list. Overall, it's a very expensive wave. And if you, if you buy all of the sets, you're looking at past $600. Last but not least is going to be the Samurai X mech, $120. And interesting, so Samurai X is going to be in this summer wave in some form. This could definitely fit as a core or legacy set, but I think it also could fit as a season 16 or 17 set, maybe with the return of Samurai X as Pixel or some new character. But uh, overall, yeah, this is an interesting wave, but honestly, I don't really have an opinion on it yet because this list is incredibly vague. What does this cruiser mean? What does Raider mean? Why is everything Golden Dragon? What is this even for? Is it core? Is it legacy? Is it season 16? Is it season 17? You, you know, there's, there's just so many unanswered questions here. And until we get a better look at the sets or more info, I have no idea what to think. And that's probably all I got for this video, guys. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed, please leave a like, subscribe, share with anyone and everyone you know. Share your thoughts and predictions for this wave below. And I'll see you guys next time.